of the role of Captain America. <laughs> Predictable. <laughs> Like everyone else here, um, I'm a Spock Yoakum fan. My question for the author of the awesome books, Mr. O'Malley, who inspired you to write the terrific series by the way the movie looks awesome? <laughs> Question because you're just so cute. I didn't hear. Who inspired me? I don't know. I, I think I inspired myself. <laughs> I'm a super genius. Ladies and gentlemen, mega mind. <laughs> uh, what's our next question? Oh, was that? Yeah, our next question. Oh, by the way, anybody with a two or three part question will be shot on site. <laughs> <laughs> um, hi, my question is for Superman. Um, oh, 
I loved getting into excellent shape, which if you watch the movie, you'll notice I, get in real, I got in really good shape for the movie. <laughs> and um, that was great. I just I felt fantastic, you know, mentally and physically. <laughs> it was a long time ago. <laughs> Why is the Captain America panel going to be this? Come on. Uh, okay, next question. Oh, this is going to be questions for Michael. Do you have any information for us on an arrest of oh. Oh. Oh, I don't have any. I don't have any information. Um, but I want it to get made. Um, well, I think it's going to. Yeah. <laughs> Michael, would you do the Arrested Development movie if the deal breaker was being in that costume for that? <laughs> sure, that sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> Hi, Jason. <laughs> um, I was just wondering if the cast. Um, were fans of the source material before they signed on to the project, or if they were fans of comics in general? Uh, well, I don't know, I can't think of the entire cast, but, uh, oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> we, uh, we loved uh, the source material. We loved it. I, yeah. I hated it. Yeah, oh, okay. Well, I speak for almost I all hated it, but the minute they said, you want to be in it, I said, fine. <laughs> Uh, but uh, it was really the combination of uh, getting to work on this uh, on this series by Brian, directed by Edgar, that really was super exciting for me because I, I love I love Edgar Wright. And then when I find out that found out that Michael Sarah was a part of it, uh, it was impossible to uh, to say no to this. Who can say no? I can. It's, it's the best thing ever. <laughs> Next question. Hard pretending to be Canadian. <laughs> That's a Karen? That's everybody, especially, well, my goal is, you know, cousin. <laughs> <laughs> well, we repeat the question, we didn't quite catch that. Oh, I'm sorry. Was it hard to be Canadian? Was it hard to uh, pretend to be Canadian? I heard something completely different than a lot right now, I'm sorry. <laughs> I am Canadian. As, as am I. And me too. It was hard to work with all these Canadians. <laughs> I think we should see who's better at America or Canada right now on stage. <laughs> um, we did shoot the film in Toronto and. Uh, and so it was amazing for us to actually be, now I don't know if you know this, but a lot of the locations in the film are based on photographic, uh, like reference that Brian like, took for the drawing. So we actually got to shoot and even hang out in a lot of the places. Brian, you want to say something? No, thank you. <laughs> Next question. Hello, Hello. Hello. Uh, this question is for Edgar Wright. And uh, when you were doing the fighting scenes, were you inspired to incorporate some fighting games or something in those fights? Yeah, there's a big, um, you know, in the books there's a big video game element, and so, you know, we wanted the different fights to appear like different levels from a video game, and as the film goes on, you obviously get to see kind of like a seven fights, well, six and a half. And, um, and so the idea was to make them feel like different levels of a video game, and so, you know, it's kind of inspired by that. So you can actually hear, within the film, you can hear some Tekken sound effects and sound effects from Sonic the Hedgehog and Zelda and Mario. Oh, and uh, I think if you've ever played any of those games growing up, there'll be very, some very familiar sounds in there. So that was definitely something we were going for, yeah. yeah. Hi, uh, my question is for uh, Captain um, America. <laughs> Did you look funny in this? Hey! Oh. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I was just wondering what kind of research you did to prepare for this awesome role. Um, you know, like fight training. We did training all together for like two months before this movie, and that was um, amazing. And while we were doing that, we were rehearsing too, and you know, 
just going over the scenes and everything. So by the time that was over, we all felt like we kind of knew the movie, I think. Right? Right, guys? They all agree with me. You can't see, but they all know. Yeah, it makes it ears. And we all, we all, like, they There was a special boot camp for fight training. Uh, the people who, um, you know, uh, did the stunt choreography, Brad Allen and Peng Zhang are like part of Jackie Chan's fight team. So we literally had Team Jackie Chan on set and trained with them every morning. Uh, and Michael Sarah like was deemed, this is absolutely true, was called the Push-Up King. Mikey the Push-Up King. <laughs> Woo! Thanks, Andrew. And I gotta say one thing. Edgar Wright came to training every morning with us. And uh, how many people would do that? So thank you, Edgar. Thank you. Woo! Well, that is good.